These are Iraqi dinar guru updates, news, opinions, and intel dinar opinion. According to newshound intel guru walking stick, this monetary change is not being impeded in the slightest. Announcement made to Iraqi population in accordance with Sudani and Alak's promises. According to Iraqi dinar intel guru Mark Z, via PDK is it appropriate for us to wait for notification today Mark Z, it is very much conceivable. Not that I would rule anything out. According to newshound guru Claire, question, do you have any idea how long the third meeting and the WDO accession period will last I can't say for sure, but I think they're really trying to finish it as quickly as possible. However, despite the fact that they inform us in articles that the next meeting will be in the first quarter of 2025, things can always change. According to Iraqi Dinar Newshound Guru Militia Man, I believe that Iraq is currently rather hot. Sudani is taking names and kicking butt. Due to the fact that the development road project will present several chances for a wide range of individuals in the area, everyone is interested. The world is now aware of his progress. Sudani is performing really well, he is laying the groundwork for the development road project to get underway. It is beginning to catch fire. It will be fantastic. According to Intel Guru FRANK26, the monetary reform is moving in the direction of increasing value, introducing new, lower denominations, altering the exchange rate, and eventually floating. We are in that phase right now. We are not yet at a point where legislation is required. We are not in a position where we require authorization from the United Nations Security Council, the United States Treasury, or anybody else. Neil Armstrong is poised to plant his right foot on the moon at this precise moment. According to Iraqi Dinar Intel newshound guru MNT Goat, oh, and did I mention that Iraq already has banking and anti-corruption measures in place as well as de-dollarization I think this all or nothing attitude is holding it back because Iraq needs its currency back online right now. My CBI contact informed me that this is especially true when it comes to attracting foreign investors, which is why the project to delete the zeros has stalled. I want to dive into subtleties of these reasons, as I feel we should simply lock in and trust that this bidden organization will end, essentially the part that is controlling the US depository and claiming to work with Iraq, the RV occurring while the liberals are in power is pretty much nothing. I have solid information from my CBI contact this is the thing has been holding up the RV. Post 2 of 2 the US Treasury will not release it. According to Intel Newshound Guru MNT Goat, again, I have to ask why the rate on Forex hasn't been reinstated yet, if only to reflect the assets of the oil rentier economy that was already established and continuing as it was prior to 1990, preceding 1990 the pace of the dinar was floating around 3.22. Therefore, why are they currently artificially lowering the rate is it now one-sixth of a penny the war has been over for 21 years, all Chapter 7 sanctions have been lifted for the past year and a half, Iraq is producing one-three as much oil as they did in 1990, their monetary reserves are the highest they have ever been, up to 150 tons of gold and many more marketable assets are currently in motion post 1 of 2. According to Iraqi Dinar Intel Guru Mark Z, via PDK, I firmly believe that Iraq has fulfilled its obligations. I continue to hear that July is still very much in the running.